Hello and welcome. I'm Anthony Hudson. It's time for Sunday afternoon football. Perfect weather here in Adelaide. Joined now by Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Today should be a great match. Today we have Port Adelaide coming up against Sydney. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. We know the scoring capabilities of both teams, so it's all about the defence of both sides. If this turns into a shootout, it becomes about which team holds up better defensively. The captains prepare for the toss of the coin. Port Adelaide wins the toss. Both these teams coming off losses. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. Players head to their positions as we prepare for the opening bounce. And here we go. It's Port Adelaide taking on Sydney. Slams it onto the boot. Good mark, and looks to send it back. Barracks goes for territory. He takes it across the line. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Punched away. Dug out the loose ball. Asprey lobs the handball. Barrett dug out the loose ball. Did well to get a hand in. McPherson gives the don't argue. Wins the race to the ball. The umpire will ball it up. One down. Thank you. Now we'll get a ball up. Thumps it clear. The ball mopped up. Wants to keep it moving. Going for goal number one. Weighing up the options now. Plays on. Chose to kick it. Doing well to intercept that kick. McCluggage goes with the kick. Salem doesn't take the mark. Might be a bit of an injury for Natanui. Going straight to the rooms. Does not look good. He's excited about that one. Sydney get the opening goal. We resume hostilities. Lysette hurls it away. Menegola rushes with the kick. Marked by Amon. Looks up with the kick. He takes the mark. Opportunity once again for Sydney to put one through. He gets above the crowd. 50 metres out. Cripps winds up and goes long. It's a foot race to get this one. Varko can't hold on to the tackle. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Moves it by foot. Can't take the mark. Hacking it out of there. The contest, no match for him. That's true, Hutto. Moved on by Asprey. Great grab. The kick from Taranto. Easily takes the mark. 
Keeps moving. Looks to move it by foot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Elects to kick. Ends up turning this ball over. Sydney fans would love to see this one sail through. McCluggage, a long way out. Goes for the goals. The drop part sails between the big sticks. He acknowledges the crowd. What a start from Sydney. About to resume play. Lysette just slaps it down. Good mark by Amon. Stabs at the kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. McCluggage will have to put everything into this one. Can he put it through? He delivers with a drop point. They stretch their lead with that effort. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Now they lead by 19. Lysette got the tap. Ace quickly onto the boot. Barris will be upset with that. He gets his hands on the footy. Doherty coming off for a spell. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. The handball now from Lloyd. With the ball is Witherden. Gets the handball away. Fends off the tackler. He takes the shot. Gets the loose ball. Mops up the loose ball. He slams it towards goal. Smiles all round. Port Adelaide get there first. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Sydney got winning the ball out of the clearance and are capitalising. It's much easier to score when you're always on the front foot. Thump by Natanui. The ball spills in the tackle. Ball collected. Going for goal number one. Goal! This one gives them a bigger lead. His teammates rush over. Sydney. Flea is now at 19. Back in the middle now. Won the hit out. McMillan controlled it well off the bounce. Got the hands free. Ace going for number one. Sends it home. This lead getting bigger now. He loved that one. 25 points the difference. Back with another centre bounce. Natanui won the hit out. Cornelio applying physical pressure. Picks up the loose ball. Scoops up the ball. Collects the loose ball. Releases the handball. Kicks hurriedly. Takes the mark all by himself. Goes by foot. They chase after the loose ball. Penetrating handball. Just put it on the boot. Archie takes it strongly. Tips it towards half forward. And the mark will be paid. Murphy will kick from beyond the 50. He decides to go for home. Port Adelaide, get happy about that one. Look at them celebrate that effort. Back in the middle. Lysette slaps it away. He has the ball. Awkwardly got the handball out. Doing well was Cox. Has it now. Going for goal number one. A drop punt through the goals. Celebrating hard. They are firing at the minute. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Big thump from Lysette. Just gets it onto the boot. A clean collect. Handball's out in front. Blank gets on the end of that handball. Slips the handball to Cox. Battle clinks up with a chance to run. Jacob takes it well. Elected to play on. 
update as we go into the break. The scores are Sydney 31, Port Adelaide 18. Sydney started well. Now it's time for them to do it for four quarters. The game was fairly open for the first quarter with plenty of goals to be had. McCluggage on top of the ranking points. He's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. Players ready to start the second quarter. About to resume hostilities. Darcy clears the contest. Just handballs into space with the ball now. Menegola just gets a boot to it. The loose ball picked up. And now we'll have a ball up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Sweeping handball. Goes by hand. Just releases the ball. The ball in the hands of Menegola at full stride receives the handball. Slams it on the boot. Martin has a great set of hands. Spears the ball. Marking in space was cross. Sydney just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Goes short by hand. Cornelio uses the bump. He lays off the pass. He can take off after that handball. He's missed it. Port Adelaide bring it back to under three goals. Plays onto himself. He drives it. Aim on. Bear to mop up. The loose ball scooped up. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Right, drives the kick. Gets into some space to mark this. Sydney have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. He celebrates hard after that. The margin is 18. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Sydney can't winning as much of the footy, but are still controlling the contest. Their efficiency with the ball is superior at the moment. Punches are clear. Releases the handball. McCluggage continues to find the ball. He seems to always be in the contest, Hutto. Good body work to win the mark. McLean kicks it to the square. The Swans haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect the forward to kick a winning total that way. Natanui just landed in his back. Jockety moves it now. My ball, says the umpire. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Natanui gathers it now. Handballs. Cripps just fends off his opponent. Couldn't snaffle it. Ends up marking uncontested. Decides to keep going. Marks now and can send it back. Searches for a teammate downfield. He wins the ball in the air. Decides to kick. Doherty marks it. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Sydney forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. A chance to reload the attack now. He couldn't hang on. Martin goes off the ground. 
McCartan gains some territory. Daniel throws the ball away. Chose to kick it. Lever got under it. Sydney for allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beat in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Asprey has it. It's a long kick. Intercepts the ball well. Up by calls. Advantage. Pendlebury has resources out wide. Cripps looks in need of a spell. Coughed up by McKenzie. Gives it to Laverde. Gets a handball away. Davis onto the ball. At full stride. Receives the handball. Fans crossing their fingers. Hoping he can put this one through the big sticks. He drives it towards goal. Stands tall and marks. 15 metres out. He takes the shot. Roberto couldn't be happier with that goal. Sydney could kick back-to-back -back goals. Sydney by four goals. Sydney have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Has a man running for it. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Ryan gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. 40 metres from home. About to take the kick. Slight angle. Going for goal number one. This kick has extended their lead. Ryan getting the crowd involved. The lead is now 30. Back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. Finds the loose ball. They can create from this. Miss the target. Cornelio just threw it. Kick by Lever. Finding the loose ball was Salem. Like We'll get a ball up on the wing. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Intervening brilliantly was Varco. Moves the ball by foot. McPherson leaps over the top. With a driving kick. Ball gets cut off. Finding the ball was Ryan. Now it's a ball up. Lysette won the hit out. Cox wins the foot race. An intriguing first half as it stands. Sydney, 49, play Port Adelaide, 19. Sydney have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. What do the stats tell us, Gaz? Sydney getting plenty of possessions at the moment. Thanks. We're halfway through this match and things are getting interesting. Ready to begin proceedings in the second half. Umpire ready to resume play. Natanui just swats it away. The bounce made it tough for Menegola. Fights the good fight. Right drives a low kick. Is accepted. Natanui just threw it. Decides to kick. Gathers it now. Barrett collects it. The umpire calls for it. Swats it. Hit the man hard. Well picked up. Tries to release the pressure. Hands that ball to the opposition. McPherson unable to hold on. Rushes with the kick. The ball mopped up. Looks to move it by foot. Doing well with the mark. 50 metres from home. Move it on. McPherson drives it at goal. Atley, the better man there. This well within range. Can he put it through? And the chance at goal is taken by Sydney. Gets his first. Atley love kicking that one. 
Sydney by six goals. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. The game is back underway. Won it down. He wins possession. Pendlebury throws the ball away. Taranto channels a long kick. Atlee with the mark. Sydney have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. They take the advantage. Drops the mark. Now they lead by 37. Players move as they look to provide an option. Frawley puts it on the boot. Marks in a bit of space. Cornelio tucks it into the pocket. An easy grab for Doherty. Moves it by foot. Lloyd takes the mark. Uncontested. Drives the ball out of defence. Cornelio marks in a bit of space. Goes with the kick. Takes a simple grab. McMillan slams it onto the boot. Lysette didn't mark it. Taranto puts on a bump. Martin marks uncontested. Listen to the fans celebrate as he drives that through. No doubt about it. That will settle his nerves. Gets his first on the ball. Gets some reward for his efforts. Thrashes it. Putting his skills on display. He looks like he needs a spell. Barcock is having a stellar match. He's everywhere at the moment. Right, gets in a good position. Laverde got hands to it. Drives it out of the pack. A mark by Salem. Decides to play on. Kicks inside the 50. McKenzie takes a strong mark. 25 metres out. 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. Going for goal number one, Sydney. Supporters delighted by that effort. A time to celebrate, and don't they get around McKenzie. The margin is 37. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Some great ball movement there. Just knew they were going to score. Sydney have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. We're back in motion. Wins the ruck duel. Ends up with McLean. Menegola uses it by foot. Ryan looks to get onto the football. Atlee has a chance to put a second goal on the board. He can't afford to be missing too many chances in front of goal. 38 points the difference. Barris ready to bring it back into play. Barris kicks hard along the boundary line. Simply outplayed his opponent. Pendlebury drives it out at defensive 50. Lining up for goal. Wright kicks it. Wright does well to mark. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this far. An ideal position to be kicking from. He likes his chances from here. Chalk a goal up for the Swans. They get around him after that effort. Sydney could have kicked the last two goals. The lead is now 44. Natanui won it down. Fighting hard was Jacobs with quick hands. Is in his possession. Murphy just threw it. Now with a low spearing kick. The mark has been taken. Goes by foot. Strong mark in the contest. Sydney just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Fantastic pressure there. Looks up with a kick. McMillan couldn't snaffle it. Goes by hand to Person. Hacking it out of there. 
Nadan Nui goes the long option. Takes the mark. 45 metres out. Should be relatively straightforward from here. Move it on. McKenzie looking to put through another goal. Here, pops through the goal. That pushes the lead further out. Congratulated teammates. That's three in a row for Sydney. The margin is 50. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Sydney are getting the ball inside 50 more than the opposition, and at the moment, they're capitalising on the scoreboard. Centre bounce. Natanui guides it down. Ryan picks up the loose ball. Darcy squeezed the handball through. Using every ounce of energy he has left. It's a turnover. Fought hard to get a handball away. Takes possession. Slick with the hands. Takes that one strongly. He drives it. Open opportunity for Chris. Sydney haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Uses it now. McMillan couldn't keep his hands on it. Doherty has had plenty of it, Gaz. He's really having a big impact on this game. Chris flicks it over. Barris kicks hurriedly. Finds a target. Cornelio rushes with the kick. As we go into the final change, the scores are Sydney 75, Port Adelaide 25. A big final term coming up. Sydney will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strongly. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. Port Adelaide giving themselves a chance on the turnover, but they can't seem to be putting it on the scoreboard. Much appreciated, Gaz. Umpire ready to begin the last turn. We're back in motion. Thumps it clear. He gets his hands on the footy. Good mark there. Hold on to the ball for a few moments and just take the sting out of the game. 40 metres from home. Okay. Going for goal number one. Drop part straight through the middle. Lysette celebrates with the fans. Sydney, Cav four on the trot. 56 points the difference. Pendlebury short by hand. Tips it towards half forward. The loose ball scooped up. Wins the race to the ball. Umpire calls for the ball. There's not too much going on at the moment. Natanui dumps it clear. Puts on a bump. Cornelia getting a chance for a break. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. Won it down. Asprey was taken high in the tackle. Puts it on the boot. Finds a bit of room to mark. Leave it with a low spearing kick. Winds up and goes long. Simply outplayed his opponent. Elects to kick. Marks all alone. Sinks the slipper into it. A great mark taken there. McCluggy elects to kick. A big contested grab. Asprey goes with the kick. Marks that ball uncontested. Does well to cut off the kick. McMillan uses it by foot. Good body work to win the mark. Tries to gain some territory. 
Nice work from Barco. 50 metres from home. Going for goal number one. Hook the kick wide. Headed behind. Laverde got hands to it. Sydney, but 57. Hunts next move. Frawley plays on. Pumps the ball long. McMillan found a way to mark that one. Uses it by foot. He gets another possession. Cripps goes by hand. Gives away a free for in the back. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. 60 metres out. Going for goal number two. The ball finds Frawley. Puts foot to ball. Finds himself in space and marks. McLean. A strong pack mark. Moved on by McCluggage. Salem gets on the end of this. 50 metres out. Almost directly in front here. Going for goal number one. A good result there, and that's a goal for Sydney. They are starting to stamp their dominance on this game. Pretty happy with that one. It's great to watch, Hado. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. The game is back underway. Tap down. Amon has the ball. He gains possession. The handball hits the target. Is in his possession. Fantastic goal by Martin. He celebrates hard after that. Port Adelaide behind by 57. He did really well there and gets the reward. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Sydney grew in front in the clearances and it's allowing them to create pressure up the field and scoring opportunities. Back with another centre bounce. Punched away. Cripps now. Shrugs the tackle. Sweeping handball. Finds his man. A chance for Taranto. Finds a target. 25 metres out. No angle to worry about. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Gets him reward for his efforts. The Swans are threatening to blow this margin wide open. It's been a clearance game and right now Sydney are on top in that area. Manufactures the handball. Turned it over. Martin contests the hard ball. Releases it under pressure. Putting this one through would give Port Adelaide plenty of confidence. This kick to keep some hope alive. He will the kick. Time's running out and there is a big margin in front of them. Ready to bring it back into play. Kept alive under pressure. Eventually the ball goes over the line. Natanui coming on. They just need to find a way to work back into the game right now. Darcy knows the pressure of the kick. A huge moment if he can convert. Got boot to ball. Hits him hard. Picks it up. Penetrating handball. Right. Just put it on the boot. Natanui did well not to fumble. Straight through the middle. Three goals so far. Great start. 
this kick stretches the lead. He loved that one. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Collected by Barco. Keeps it moving. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Barracks runs after this one. Slams it on the boot. Marking in space was McMillan. Strong mark in the contest. Drives the kick hard. Gets it away. Linking by hand. Clock running out in the final term. Amon unable to lay the tackle. Gathers it now. They are desperate for a goal now. Thumping kick and just off line. Probably not enough time left for them to get back in this. I haven't seen him for a while, Gas. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him... Not the most exciting match, but the fans of the winning side will feel pretty good right about now. Your final word on today's game, Gas? Just a fantastic performance from Sydney. They really put in the hard yards and they can enjoy the result. The final scores are in. Sydney, 100. Port Adelaide, 33. Well, that's all we have time for. Thanks for joining us. Thank you, Gaz. Thanks, Hanno. I've enjoyed every minute of it.